Yeah, I thought our effort was good against Colorado. Our execution wasn't always there, but you got to give them some credit. But um, it's a good any win, and the Pac-12 is a good win. I thought our guys played hard. We got some uh, outstanding performances from some guys that have been consistent all year, and then a couple of new guys emerged as well. And, uh, and we're a little banged up. I think there was 20-some guys, 25 guys on the injury report this morning. I'm not going to go through the whole list. So it's going to be an important week to get guys healthy. we got to get some young guys ready to play at a high level against a very talented Washington team that uh, I've read that may have three or four guys on defense alone that will be very high NFL draft picks. I'm talking first or second rounders. And they might be the biggest team we play all year if you look at the size of their guys. So, I mean, they got running backs as big as our nose guard. And so we've got, we got a big challenge in front of us, and hopefully we'll have a big crowd. It's nice to have a day game uh, from a coach's standpoint just to wake up and play. So it'll be an important week for us. As we thought all year, it's, it's, uh, it's a team that's just going to have to keep competing. You know, we gave out the big play, the first play of the game, and everybody's probably like, oh, boy, what's going to happen? And our guys just play. They just keep competing. We're not getting a lot of three and outs, which I wish we could get more. But uh, even that being said, when a team is driving a ball on us, our guys are still playing to the end and making them truly earn when they get touchdowns for the most part. So uh, I've been, been pleased with it. I think our defensive staff is doing a really good job of, of, of preparing each week because it's difficult. In our league, you see so many different systems and so many talented skilled players that it's hard for week to week to get them ready, and they're doing a really nice job. Some of the short yardage runs were – uh, some of them were, we weren't getting pushed, and some of them was just, we could have had a better play called with that, and they just outnumbered us. So, uh, you know, it wasn't – sometimes you always point to the old line as, as, as being the fault at that, and it wasn't all that. And I thought we did okay up front. We got better in the second half when we really had to. But we're still not getting some of the push that we need. And you got to give credit to some of the, some of the defenses, especially this front that you know, we're playing this week. You're talking about six of the seven are seniors, and a couple of those guys are NFL guys. So it, it's going to be a challenge. So we better play with great leverage. But one thing about our players, I think they know that when they watch it on film and, and if they want to compare themselves against the best and guys that will be playing on Sundays, they're going to get a chance to do it this weekend. You know, that's uh, one thing we're always trying to do is, uh, you know, get as many turnovers as we can and, uh, you know, keep the ball in the – the offense's hands as much as possible. And I think we've uh, done a good job of that the last few weeks. And, uh, you know, it just comes from, uh, you know, everyone getting after it, doing their assignments, and, uh, you know, kind of just having that defensive mentality we try to have. It's it, it's a lot of mental, um, but uh, definitely uh, catch up to the speed of the game and and get a little more uh, confidence in myself and and uh, and knowing the play, knowing the linebackers around me and what we're the tendencies and stuff. So that, that's helped a lot for sure.